What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Mr. Williams, and I am coming to you today with another custom. Today, I'm going to be customizing my true wireless earbuds, and I'm going to be putting the Gucci Strike. I'm, I decided to do this because it was quick and easy, and I wanted to show y'all how to show y'all how easy it is. All right, so first, I want to say like, subscribe, and hit my notification bell, and I will be doing a giveaway very soon so I need y'all to like I said like subscribe and uh, hit that notification bell and to leave a comment that you're entering the giveaway all right so let me go ahead and get into this video to show, tell you what I'm doing all right so what you're seeing right now is me putting some white base coat on uh, what you didn't see me do is prep the surface already I use some acetone to wipe it down and whatnot and then I use tape to tape off where I'm going to be painting on uh, prep work prep work prep work that's all I can say alright so like I said I'm putting this base coat I put a few layers on of white they say that this stuff is hard it's not you just gotta understand what you're doing and do it. Sometimes this stuff can get a little messy. As you'll see here in a second, I get it on my fingers. I get it all on the true wireless uh, headsets. And by the way, no, I am not sponsored by these people. I just like true wireless speakers. So as after I've already put on my face coat, I am going over it one last time, and I'm doing it in smooth strokes because if you don't, you'll get these blotchy looks, and it won't look right. So you go the full length of whatever surface it is. See, got stuff all over my finger. And then I stick my whole hand in the paint. All you can do is just go right back over it. I'm trying to show you the difference between the back and the front. Alright, so I took some acrylic green and uh, after I wash my paintbrush, I'm going over the white. Also, I, you have to put a background because the white will show up, will make the colors pop a lot more than it would if it was on a black. So you gotta, you gotta, again, that's that prep work, prep work, prep work. I do want to say, when it comes to the to the the tape, you gotta press down real hard on that tape because that tape, if it's not pressed down, will leave some little gaps in between, and the paint will get in. You'll see that at the closer to the end of the video because I didn't press down hard enough. Oh, so right here you'll see me hold it at certain angles because when you're trying to dry, blow dry, well heat dry, the paint will turn from a glossy to this dull look and that's what I'm looking for when I'm trying because I'll indicate that it, the surface is dry. Blotchy. Not watching. 
I do want to take the time to say thank y'all and subscribe and share this video if you liked it. It's not done, I just wanted to throw that out there. I wanted to get this done today in one day because I wanted to put a video out. I haven't done it in a long time. I know y'all been looking. And since I hit my 100 subscribers, it's about that time. It's about that time. Y'all, y'all help me do this. So I have to say thank you. So what I'm pointing to right now is where the tape was and where I'm going to put the second layer of tape for the red stripe. And I tell you now, with these bends and this weird shape, it's hard to get this tape just right. But, through trial and error, you can get it done. Not everything's gonna come up perfect the first time around. product I fix my mistakes and it's one of my favorite air, air bug cases I think that's what they are my earbud cakes that I have it's one of my favorite before I get started on the red I wanted to let y'all know with the tape again all kinds of things can happen with me po putting this tape on this paint after it's been, the top's been dry doesn't mean the bottom's been dry and with me putting the tape on trying to be careful this it can pull up the, uh, the paint that I just put down and so in my head at this moment I'm hoping I am hoping that it's on there it's, it's on there to stay <laughs> like I said I wanted to get this done fast you never really want to rush your artwork Alright, as I'm finishing this up, I'm showing y'all, I'm going to be showing y'all exactly what I meant by the tape. And this is me explaining to y'all about the tape situation. Blah blah blah, tape, blah blah blah, pill, blah blah blah, residue. <laughs> now check this out. Did I or did I not get lucky? Alright, 
so I want to take this time to say thank you and subscribe and to share this video if y'all like it and to give it through to everybody else. Show them that it's not hard to do this. Alright? I really do appreciate it. And I, I'm going to let y'all go. Love, peace, and chicken grease.